Are you on the road to financial success or are you stuck in a financial rut? This is the question that echoes in the minds of many. Financial literacy, a crucial key to unlocking the door to wealth creation, often remains a distant concept for too many. It's not about becoming a millionaire overnight. No, it's about cultivating good money habits that pave the way to financial freedom. Imagine a life of luxury where passive income flows like a river, allowing you to enjoy the finer things without the constant worry of depleting your resources. This is the promise of financial success. Today, we will reveal 15 money spending habits you must avoid to achieve financial success. Welcome back to Wealth Minds Elite, the place where we redefine success one elite mind at a time. First, avoid living beyond your means. It's a simple concept, but often overlooked. When you spend more than you earn, you're setting yourself up for debt and financial instability. This doesn't mean you can't enjoy life or indulge occasionally. It means creating a budget that reflects your earnings and sticking to it. It means understanding the difference between wants and needs. It means living within your means now to build a financially secure future. Remember, wealth is not about how much you earn, but how much you keep. And while you're figuring out your budget, why not budget some time to hit that subscribe button? It's free and could be the best investment you've made for your financial literacy. Next, curb impulsive buying. It's a dangerous habit that can quickly drain your finances. Those on the spot purchases might seem harmless, but they add up, often leading to financial strain. It's crucial to plan your shopping. Create a list and stick to it, resisting the allure of marketing tactics and spontaneous desires. This discipline prevents impulse buys driven by emotions, helping you to stay in control of your spending. So remember, make your shopping list your new best friend. Third, stop trying to keep up with the Joneses. It's a race you'll never win. You see, when we compare our lives to others, we tend to overlook our own financial goals and realities. We start to spend money on things we don't need just to match someone else's lifestyle. The thing is, the Joneses aren't paying your bills or planning your financial future. So why let their choices dictate yours? It's time to redefine success on your own terms. Create your own financial path, not someone else's. Fourth, beware of lifestyle inflation. It's an enticing trap, one that's easy to fall into. As your income increases, the temptation to upgrade your lifestyle grows. Swankier cars, grander homes, luxurious vacations, they all beckon, whispering the promise of a high life. But giving in to these urges can lead to unnecessary spending and financial instability. Remember, the goal is to build wealth, not just to display it. So by all means, treat yourself occasionally, but don't let lifestyle inflation up your hard-earned income. Rise in income should not always mean a rise in expenses. And remember, if your lifestyle is inflating, make sure your subscription list is too. Hit that subscribe button. Fifth, avoid making only minimum payments on your credit card. Let's delve into this a bit. Every time you make only the minimum payment, you're essentially kicking the can down the road. What you're also doing is accumulating interest, and that can grow into a daunting mountain of debt. It's like a snowball that gets bigger and bigger as it rolls downhill. The more you owe, the more interest you accumulate, and the cycle continues. It's a trap that keeps you in debt longer and costs you more. The best course of action? Aim to clear your debts, not prolong them. Sixth, don't shy away from requesting pay raises. It might feel uncomfortable, but it's crucial to understand your worth and confidently ask for what you deserve. Remember, your salary is a reflection of your value to the company. If you're performing well and contributing to the business, it's only fair that your compensation reflects this. By negotiating your salary, you're not just improving your financial situation, you're asserting your worth and setting a standard for your future earnings. Don't undervalue your work, you deserve that raise. Seventh, don't just save, invest. Having money in the bank is good, but to truly grow your wealth, you need to invest. It's not merely about tucking away your hard-earned cash, it's about making that cash work for you. By investing, you're giving you the chance to generate more money. This is where the magic of compound interest comes in. It's akin to a snowball effect. Your wealth starts to grow exponentially over time, not linearly. So remember, saving is good, but investing is better. 
let your money work for you. And hey, speaking about work, while you're letting your money work for you, why not let your mouse do some work too? Click that subscribe button. It's the least your mouse can do, considering how hard your money is working. Eighth, stop hoarding cash. Now you might be thinking, but cash is king, right? Well, not exactly. The truth is, inflation is a silent thief, quietly robbing your money of its value over time. It's like a slow leak in a tire. You may not notice it right away, but eventually you'll find yourself stranded with a flat. So instead of stashing your cash under a mattress, consider investing it. Investments can grow your wealth, counteracting the effects of inflation. Remember, your mattress is for sleeping, not for storing wealth. Ninth, don't invest blindly. When it comes to wealth creation, uninformed investments can be as harmful as not investing at all. Financial literacy plays a pivotal role here. It's crucial to educate yourself about various investment options, their risk factors, and potential returns. Get to grips with different market conditions. Understand the nuances of stocks, bonds, mutual funds, and real estate. Seek advice from trusted financial advisors if needed. Remember, every informed decision you make brings you a step closer to your financial success. Knowledge is power, especially in investing. Tenth, be cautious when lending money. It's a generous act to lend money to those in need, but without assurance of repayment, it can lead to serious financial harm. Often the line between a friendly loan and charity blurs. It's essential to distinguish between the two and ensure that your act of kindness doesn't morph into a financial nightmare. When lending, make sure there's a clear agreement about repayment. Remember, your goal is financial success, and lending money without a safety net can jeopardize that. Charity is noble, but don't let it ruin your finances. Eleventh, don't evade taxes. It might seem tempting to hold back a bit from the taxman, but let's get real here. Evading taxes can lead to a slew of penalties that could seriously dent your financial health, and that's not even mentioning the potential legal issues. Imagine being slapped with a tax evasion charge. Yeah, not a good look. Instead, be smart about it. Understand your tax obligations and work them into your financial planning. Taxes are unavoidable, so plan for them. Twelfth, maximize your tax advantaged accounts. These accounts, like individual retirement accounts and 401, K's are not just your average piggy banks, they're powerful tools for wealth creation. By contributing the maximum amount each year, you're not only putting away money for your future, but also reducing your current taxable income. Think of it as a double win. You save for retirement and pay less tax now. So don't just let these accounts sit idle. Contribute to them, grow your wealth, and let the tax laws work in your favor. Thirteenth, don't rely on a single income stream. Just like a stream can dry up, so can one source of income. It's a risk too high for your financial health. Diversifying your income, whether through part-time work, investments, or side businesses, acts as financial insurance. It's akin to not putting all your eggs in one basket. You're spreading the risk, creating a safety net, and opening doors to wealth creation. So remember, put your eggs in different baskets. Fourteenth, don't neglect budgeting. You see, keeping tabs on your spending is like having a financial compass. It guides you towards making informed decisions and ensures you're not straying off your wealth-building path. Without a budget, you're like a ship lost at sea, tossed around by the waves of impulsive purchases and unplanned expenses. It's easy to lose sight of your financial goals when you're not tracking where your money goes. Remember, a budget isn't a limitation, it's a tool for financial success. Budgeting is the first step towards wealth creation. Fifteenth, avoid gambling. Now, the allure of instant wealth can be tempting, but remember, gambling is a game of chance with odds often stacked against you. Chasing quick wealth often leads to losses and can derail your financial success. Instead, focus on sustainable wealth-building strategies that involve time, effort, and informed decisions. These are the hallmarks of true financial literacy and the secrets to creating lasting wealth. Remember, becoming a millionaire isn't about getting lucky. It's about making smart choices. Gambling is not an investment strategy. So elite minds, are you ready to embark on your path to financial freedom? Let's recap. Avoid living beyond your means, 
impulsive buying, and trying to keep up with the Joneses. Don't let lifestyle inflation outpace your income. Aim to pay more than just the minimum on your credit card, and don't be shy about requesting pay raises. Remember, saving money is great, but investing is key for wealth creation. Don't let your money lose value under your mattress, and make sure your investments are informed. Be cautious when lending money, and always stay on top of your tax payments. Utilize tax-advantaged accounts, and strive to diversify your income streams. Budgeting is your friend, don't neglect it. And remember, gambling might seem like a quick way to riches, but sustainable wealth building requires time, effort, and informed decisions. Financial literacy is your secret weapon on this journey. It's the key to unlocking the wealth secrets of the millionaire mindset. The luxury lifestyle you dream of is within reach. But remember, it's not just about being rich, it's about achieving financial freedom. Before we wrap up, here's a challenge for you. I bet you can't hit that like button, share this video, and subscribe to our channel faster than you can swipe that credit card. Go on, try it. It's a race against your own financial habits. And remember, if you can't avoid these bad spending habits, at least avoid forgetting to like, share, and subscribe.